Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, Rad here from Rats with Tarot and this is going to be daily tarot reading for June 23rd, 2018. So, four cards spread and the first card that shows up the topic of the day and then we do have a, a second card which shows up the, the worst possible approach we could take regarding that particular day or in other words the negativity, things we shouldn't do etc etc. Then we do have the third card which points up the best possible approach toward the day, the, possible, the, the positive intentions we could have, things we could achieve etc etc. And then we do have the fourth card which is the the long-term benefit in case we do have these couple of conditions checked from the day. So let's go to the topic here, uh, which is, let's see, that will be the Five of Swords, all right. So the topic points that that particular day, it will be, uh, first of all, very busy, speedy, speedy, if I may say it that way. So uh, maybe we will find ourselves short in time to make uh, more, uh, more likely, you know, uh, a balanced judgment or rather like to uh, take on a, a meticulously information before we actually take the decision so it's very important during that day guys not to make any harsh actions and harsh decisions five of swords it is a, a violent card in the sense of that one could um, over exaggerate its own uh, sense for righteousness all right so it will be very important here not to act irrationally it is very important not to judge before you know everything because this card also has a prerequisite for mental cruelty humiliation um, <clears throat> being given a, a bad thong a, a bad treatment as well um, and this kind of stuff. That card also gives us a, a chance to, um, if we are ready to pay a high, a high cost, to actually end up victorious as well, all right? But also, that will be a, a bit of victory if we don't know our own personal limitations. Because in some, in some uh, cases, that card comes as a contract with the devil. In other words, you pay much more than you actually can get as a benefit from the situations that they present to you. So all that I ask here looking at that card is that you should not be hasty when it comes to initiation, when it comes to taking taking a decision uh, regarding something during that particular day because you can because you may deprive yourself from a much more beneficial outcome of the situation than the outcome you're going to have very important to be said here is to not judge as well all right because um, your judgment could be blinded by something by a circumstances especially if uh, the situation regards something there to your heart and then we do have how we should not uh, approach the situation here with the Queen of Cups. So that speaks for a, um, I don't know how to explain it really, that speaks for a support we seek uh, that will encourage us to do everything that I said we should not do in the previous day. So um, let's say that you have that kind of like self-righteousness which goes in the wrong way, all right, and you still seek a support for uh, from your mother let's say or a motherhood figurine etc etc during that day and as they support you that will uh, additionally on feed our you know just not just self-righteousness but as well recklessness and and ruthlessness that is also very possible that we can become ruthless because we're gonna face support from people but that support won't be an, an objective support okay that support is going to be totally out of love which is not an objective support because because one person loves you he's going to or she is going to support you regardless of what you're doing all right and all the time saying is that during that day just because we are affected emotionally from the situation we could do stupid things we could do wrong things all right and not just we also we could be a victim of those of, of such kind of behavior or such kind of a circumstances so we have to be extra careful during that day and the key to avoid all that is to know our limitations and to know the limitations in general of the situation at all then we do have the best possible approach or the things we can achieve here. That will be the Prince of Pentacles so pre or a Page of Pentacles. So instead of us, you know, um, kind of attending ourselves into uh, 
these uh, violent activities, etc., etc., the Page of Pentacles speaks that at this particular moment into our, in our lives, there is something that is an unfolding which is un unaffected by that situation marked with the Five of uh, Swords. That thing, it's like a... Um, Mm, it's like a flower blooming in our gar in, in our garden, all right, and we have to nurture it. And during that day, instead of us throwing ourselves into battles that there is no one that is going to be beneficial out of them, we should uh, apart, uh, we should instead, you know, devote ourselves into that fragile yet uh, agenda task or even a dream just for example uh, let's say I, I, I want to give you here an example let's say that you're going through a divorce and instead of now throwing all the energy you got uh, into that divorce at that particular day accusing your husband or a wife of something and you have an accusations uh, returned etc uh, etc et why don't you um, instead you know focus all that energy positively toward the child you have all right that could be as well a thing or in different ways it could be into your career that you are seriously disrupted in a certain project that you are working from a colleague of yours and you are blaming them for the failure they are blaming you for the failure uh, and, and instead of, of focusing into that kind of a magic circle you can focus on a different project there which is just starting and it requires your devotion and that will kind of like you know not only just to shoot you from a negative energy but as well is going to give you something to look forward to and that is very important so uh, that kind of a thing here that day particularly requires from us not to be again irrational and to know our limitations and instead of throwing ourselves into battle that there will be no winners at all uh, we should rather uh, attend into activities agendas etc that uh, actually are just starting and it depends only on us so the other thing will not the other thing there are more people involved in it but in this that we can um, how can I place it we can um, diverse our efforts too uh, is depending only on us all right that will make uh, our day much more productive and much more pleasant and in a long-term prospect we do have the three of cups so we have the success here all right or at least that card points that we are going to see the fruits of our efforts into that agenda here all right and the problems from that day that we do have were the arguments, the fights, and in the scandals, etc., etc., they will be no longer relevant for our lives because what we had there to look forward to is now materializing, all right? And we, we can start reaping off the fruits of our labor. Very important here. So there are those days, guys, which we have to actually choose one evil over another or the lesser, the lesser evil all right or there are those days so we can um we have to choose to sacrifice one thing over another and that is one of those days all right that we need to sacrifice one thing that it is way too uh cost efficient to chase for another thing that could be much more cost effective and i hope we all make the right choice for uh for every single one of us all right so pretty much that was the daily tarot reading for uh <clears throat> june uh 23rd 2018 and i hope you guys enjoyed it and you liked it and in case you're interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video rod signing out now see you next time bye